welcome to my youtube channel today i'm going to be showing the video on a full face makeup how i achieved this look we will be thoroughly explained in and the rest of the um details will be in the description um right now this is the end look of the full face makeup i'm going to be starting with carving my eyebrow i'm using h and e eyebrow gel so as you can see i'm using the brush to carve the eyebrow you put the brush in the gel and use it to carve your eyebrow then after carving the eyebrow i would ensure that i brush it in very well because um you know the product we're using is gel like and where i'm um, having this video where i'm um doing the video it's a bit cold i have ac and fan on so i guess that's why the gel will get dry quickly so what you do is you brush the um the um, gel you brush it in very well and smoothly to ensure that the eyebrow is properly in place so that's what i'm doing right now i'm trying to brush it i'll brush the upper part i'll brush it upward that's the entrance the edge of the eyebrow then the other part i'll brush it downwards as you can see that's what i'm doing right now then i'll brush the other parts downward then i'll do the same thing to the other eyebrow the, the way i um did the eyebrow on the um left that's the way i'm doing it on the right hand side so that's what i'm doing right now as you can see i'm just following the normal procedure that's what i'm doing right now yeah as you can see i'm trying to brush in the gel so that it will come out well yeah um the clip is um i speed the clip so that's why that's why it's going so fast so i'm trying to brush the um edge of the brows upward and the rest of it downward so after this as you can see after brushing it what the next thing to do right now is to define the eyebrow so I'm using um, BH Cosmetics um, 10 Shades Concealer Palette. That's the shade I'm using. So just watch me as I'm going to define the eyebrow. I'm using um, Zaron Brush, um, um, Angle Brush. That's what I'm using to define the eyebrow. So just follow it carefully. If you follow it carefully, you'll be able to do the same. Um, I hope you can see so that's what i'm doing sorry um the light went off here i'm supposed to stop the video but i didn't stop the video on purpose um because the light will soon come up i'm sorry about that um accept my apology if uh, you cannot see clearly um I advise that you check other videos you check my video i think i have um other video for eyebrow and eyeshadow techniques so you can check other video for eyebrow and eyeshadow techniques So I'm going to do the same on the other eyebrow. I'm trying to define the other eyebrow now. That's what I'm doing. Then please uh, make sure that the concealer you're using is not too much. If it's too much, it will be messy. So that's why I'm, I'm trying as much as possible not to make the concealer um, too much so that it won't be messy and it will define it well. You just need a little on the tip of the brush. It's an angle brush, so it will go whichever way you want it to go. That's it. So after the eye eyebrow, the next thing to do is um, eyeshadow techniques. So I'm trying to brush the eyebrow properly so it will be in place. The outer part um, upward and the rest of it downwards as you can see that's what i did so right now i'm applying the eyeshadow base that's the primer that's what i'm doing right now before you can apply the eye color sorry in this video the eyeshadow clip it, it got corrupted so i didn't include the video so sorry like i said earlier you can check my other videos for eyebrow and eyeshadow techniques i'm sorry about that so after this the next thing 
I'm showing in the video is um, foundation application. So I'm using um, LA Girl Primer. Then after preparing the face by applying the primer on the face and um, you blend it into the skin very well. The next thing I'm going to use is my foundation. That's FM Foundation in Sandalwood. That's what I used. Um, FM Foundation is really good. It has um, um, total coverage, very high coverage and it's HD. So you can use it as well. I have um, acne and um, some spots, pimple on my face. So that's why I chose this foundation because it covers very well. As you can see, I'm using a beauty blender. I'm trying to blend in the foundation into my skin so that it will blend in and cover all my face flaws. As you can see, that's what I'm doing right now. So after blending the foundation, the next thing to do is um, H and C. So um, for H and C, I used um, I used um, LA Girl um, concealer in um, fan and toffee. That's what I used. So I'm trying to highlight my face. I'm going to put the lighter shade on underneath my eye my two eye and um on my forehead on the bridge of my nose um on the side of my um cheek and on my jaw as you can see i'm using um another beauty blender to blend the concealer into my skin i'll ensure that it's properly blend and there are no mistakes please when you're doing yours make sure that it's not cakey use the beauty blender or you can use the new silicone sponge i don't have it yet that's why i didn't use it to blend in the concealer for h and c because if you don't blend very well it will become cakey and it won't come out well so that's what i'm doing I think in this video, um, the setting of the H and C is not included. I think that also got corrupted. I can't find it here. I thought it was here. Sorry about that. But I have other videos in my channel that um, where I showed uh, full H and C. You can check that. So sorry about that. I'm trying to blend. So since I don't have the video of the setting of the um, H and C, the next thing on the video is um, my lipstick, lipstick application. The face is ready. So I'm applying the lipstick. I'm using um, this 24 hours um, cream to matte lipstick liquid to matte lipstick in red and this pink is zaron lipstick i i don't know the name right now so i'll check the name and include it in the description so you can check for it so i'm trying to apply the lipstick right now when you're applying the lipstick make sure that on the cubit of your mouth you have the x sign you just use your pencil your liner your lip liner to draw the x and you can form the shape of the lip that's it so right now the face is ready i'm trying to blow, bronze my face i'm using glow um um milani bronzer baked bronzer that's what i used and i'm using my fan brush to apply the bronzer on uh, my uh, cheekbone and on the my uh, the nose of my the bridge of my nose sorry about that the bridge of my nose my forehead and my jaw then on the cubit of my mouth as well, I also applied the bronzer just to bring out the shape of the lip. That's what I did. So right now, I'm trying to use more of the contour. The powder that I use to contour is um, lice. I don't know if you've heard of lice. I use lice powder in cocoa. That's what I use to contour my face. So right now, the face is ready.
then um that's my setting spray i use zaron so my face is ready so thank you for watching thank you so much for watching if you like this video please kindly like this video kindly thumbs up for me subscribe to my channel so you can get more updates on my other video thank you so much for watching please um check the description box for the details of the product used and also your comment is very important please leave your comments in the comment box thank you for watching see you next time bye